waiting for the usual delay. Apologies. Sorry, it's just being slow again. Uh, right, I think we're all good. Let's have a little, uh, little audio check. Alright, we're all good. Hello everyone, welcome to another um, Twitch live stream of FIFA 21, uh, another career mode transfer saga. Uh, so, I went back on this earlier to check my Man U career, and it turns out it stopped saving after, well, I think I overwrote the auto saves. I forgot to like save manually when I was done with the last one. So technically it's back in February of the first season. So that's fun. Um, so basically I might just look at getting rid of those. Uh, can I, whilst I'm at it, uh, I'm going to see if I can find the, I forgot what I was talking about now, the save files. And I will look at uh, do, 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 do. I'll look at getting rid of them. Um, uh, right, where are they? Game settings. Is it under here? No, that's just regular game settings. I forgot what it's under. Uh, uh, profile? Don't want to delete my profile. Oh, there we go. Never mind. Um, so let's get rid of these. I'll get rid of the two because I think the first one might be my original one. Probably. Not sure. Uh, I was going to say, uh, I'm normally up at this time, so, uh, es especially with all the sleep I got um, from having my second jab, I definitely got plenty of hours in, but I, I'm, I'm normally up till about four or so anyway. Um, I'm going to be doing a Red Bull Salzburg edition, uh, mainly because that's the team that Pats and Dak is from. Um, I'm very excited to see what he does for Leicester. Uh, it's it's a bit unfortunate they didn't really get to play today. I did take them out of my fancy team before that because I was like, well, they've still got Vardy and Acho, so I don't know if Daka's just a backup for them. Um, apparently, there's a report that Roma might be after Ian Acho if they don't get Tammy Abraham. Um, right, I'm just going to quickly load the first career save because I want to see what it is. I don't think because this one's back from December, so this might be the one that I was getting the achievements and. Um, so I'll, I will, like I said, I'll be doing a Red Bull Salzburg edition. Uh, the Brentford one actually didn't go too bad. Um, so this one I've got Ben Yedder. Yeah, I think I remember this one. So I've got, who have I got? Ings, Mora, Tielemans, Van der Beek, Ndidi, De La Feu, Bernard, Alderweireld, Fernandinho, Pereira, Henderson. They've got St. Maximan, Sionchu, Ben Yedder, Traore, Silva, Williams, other Pereira, Fossiman, Fernandez is out injured. Oh yeah, he was like a 91 at some point. Um, yeah, I think I remember this one. Uh, so my fancy team, I've got two that I do with, like some with friends, some with family. So the the Premier League app, I only got 29 points. I've, I think I've still got Ruben Diaz to play tomorrow, and that's it. Um, I mean, the only one that did alright for me was Van Dijk. Luckily, I captained him. The rest are literally just all twos and ones. Um, and then my Sky Sports one, I think I did really well in. Um, I think I'm on 77? I'll have a look. Uh, yeah, 77. So... Allison got me 11 points. Van Dijk, our captain, has got me 20. Maguire's got me 2. Vestergaard got me 1. Barnes got me 2. 
Fernandez got me 23. If I captained him, I would have got 46 for him. Havertz got me one. Willock, I'm hoping, plays for Newcastle tomorrow. I know they signed him yesterday or Friday. Uh, whether that gets him in the team, I don't know. Ings got me seven. Tony got me ten. Uh, and then Jesus, I've still got to play tomorrow. So, we'll see. Um, hey, what was I doing? I cannot remember. I'm I'm really crap at remembering stuff, to be honest. My brain is just sort of like... If I try and multitask, it's like, oh, this thing you remembered, gone. Um, I tell you what, let's check quickly check the transfers on this one because I just want to see what transfers I've done uh, have I done no transfers I guess it just doesn't save it after a while I, I guess I probably did all those in like the first season which is probably why there are technically none right so new career let's get uh, Red Bull Salzburg use current squads Magic career. Would that mean technically Daka won't be at? Surely he would be, because he has been in the other careers. For some reason, they've just not registered that he's not there anymore. Uh, RB Salzburg. Ah. Uh, Sucks to hear that. Uh, yeah, the virus definitely does suck when you have it. Uh, I've unfortunately had it twice. Normally, both occasions have been due to excessive time and cold temperatures. Um, my first one was I was working in a place that was essentially a frozen warehouse. Uh, I was fine for a good month or so, and then it basically kicked in. Uh, and then the second one was from working night shifts, working frozen. Uh, after the fourth night of that, I yeah, I just wasn't well. Um, but you rest up um, this this will be going on YouTube as well so if you ever want to watch it it is on there obviously it will also be on the Twitch backlog so yeah it'll always be there but thanks for joining in anyway it's been nice chatting with you again New one, progress to uh, let's go for the European International Cup, where I guess our biggest threat is probably Watford. Right, so let's have a look at the squad. Okay, Dakar is in this one. So it ranges from 70 to 77. So I'd say if I could get one or two 80s in here, I'd say that's the win. I mean, the goalkeeper's the easiest thing to do. So, what are the formations? Two central defensive mids, two central attacking mids. Two strikers, left, two centre-backs, left back, right back. Okay, I can do that. Um... So the regular stuff, uh, right, everyone's going on sale. Oh, I went, oh, okay, I was kind of expecting that to go into a loading screen. Add to transfer list. Oh, he's on loan at New York Red Bulls, so he's just switched one Red Bull team to another. A leader of men, meaning he's a captain. Oh, I remember Ulmer. I signed him for uh, Brentford, I think. Oh, don't terminate loan. Um, he's on loan, he's on loan. Showing great potential. Could mean I could get maybe a decent amount for him. The nice thing is some of these are quite young as well. So... I could get 
some decent money from them. I think Daka would be my biggest seller. Like, he'll be at least 20, hopefully. Ah, another Zambia player. I think he's been bought by someone recently. I think he has. Because I remember it's like, Daka was like the big whole Zambia thing. And then there was another Zambian signing that went somewhere. I'm going to look that up um, once I've done this. Some of these are showing great potential, which is hopeful for money. Showing great potential. I mean, he's only 17, so... Showing great potential, and he's 18. Showing great potential, he's 21. He'll get me the most money, I think. Right, that is everyone. Um, what's his name? Mwepo. I'm just going to have a look, see if he's been signed by someone recently. Because I definitely feel like he has. And not worth it. Oh, Brighton. Yeah. There you go. Brighton signed him. I was like, I knew I saw it somewhere. Oh, my control battery. So, like, uh, right. So, it's going to go quiet for about 20 seconds. Right. Just going to do an audio check quickly. Okay, we're all good. We are all good. It's the one thing I worry about once I disconnect this. It's like, oh, that audio you had, gone. Um, I right, kind of advanced in time. Right, transfers. Uh, global transfer network. Where are we looking? Austria, South Korea, France. Right. Relocate. Check England for me. Yes. Relocate uh, Germany. You can go to Spain. I'll, what funds have I got? I didn't check that actually. Because it's a dumb move. 18 million. Right, I'll get another scout and I will say he can go to Italy. Uh. Go for you because you want too expensive. So experience will find a larger number of players. Judgment will find a higher quality of players. Right, so it's always better to go for judgment. Uh, and then you can go to Italy because they're the only ones I know decentish players. Um, scout instructions. Let's go for. Uh, I'm going to put first team quality as well for that one. Um, keep that one. Uh, position. Uh, winger, first team quality. Position, full back. Uh, First team quality and box to box position center back tall and strong probably won't get much and then this one goalkeeper world class and he's gonna be over 30 there we go. Ah, Samtok, I believe you've been in before. How's it going? Yeah, you were in a few days ago, weren't you? Uh, it's good to see you back. I'm doing a uh, Red Bull Salzburg edition this time. Uh, mainly because Pats and Dakar plays all of them. And I wanted to see how I would do with a team from a different country that 
funnily enough, has kind of like a similar budget to Brentford. Um, yeah, I know, player chat, all that stuff. I'm really not first. Ah, okay. Just kick me out of the messages. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I'm very sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, only a few of them have said something, which is fine. Uh, right, let's carry on. Because I know I can get a really good goalkeeper for not much money. It just depends if they want to come here, that's all. Uh, quick sim this one. Funnel, meh, yeah, it's fine. Uh, so the budget at the moment is, well, it was 18 million, but I've just got an extra scout for like 1.2 million. So I think at the moment it's like 17 million. All right, here we go. Uh, 4 million for him. What's his price range? Between 3.9 and 5. Right, let's delegate that one because I want a little bit more. Uh, 1.4. Your friend is 64. That's apparently worth 1.2. Delegate. We can probably get more out of this player. So. Yeah, so uh, so far it's 17.33 million with 100,000 wages. Um, which. Will go up a bit higher, I think, especially if DACA does get sold. Uh, looks like Tottenham have already made a giant uh bid for someone well got someone transfer that's the, that's the word i was talking about it's literally the thing the whole transfer for him um going to have a look and see who it is if it's devrige from inter i swear to god right top transfers alaba that's an interesting one alaba to tottenham 29 million uh matter to wolfsburg wendell to everton um any others of interest? No, because then it's just free. Okay. Some interesting-ish stuff. Oh, international management stuff. Not really too fussed about that. Right, we've got a sale agreement. Weber's got an offer. Middlesbrough wanted for six and a half million. Between five point nine... Let's delegate that one. If I can get a bit more for him... Oh, I forgot the other one. Damn it, hang on. So the sale agreement's been reached for 2.1 million. I'll take it. I think I can get some good players in for not so much. Oh, Martinez to Real Madrid. Got another sale agreement. 5.8 million. Uh, yes, I'll take 5.8 million. I think the benefit of some players being younger in like the 70s overall is you get quite a bit for them. Another one all. Lovely. Watford haven't been doing well. What a shame. I mean, I can't say the same for the Premier League because they actually won 3-2, I think. It's nice to have the Premier League back. Uh, if Kevin Trapp comes in my thing, I have put 30 and over world-class goalkeepers. I believe he's an 84. So, he might come up. Oh, sale agreement. Six and a half million. I will take it. That's quite a bit of money. He's 81. So, I think, think world-class counts as 80 and over. So, I'll actually check my transfers now because it's been a while. Ketia, I think he's only a 60-something. So that doesn't work for me. Uh, right, where are we going? Goalkeeper. Right, who have we got? <sighs> Mandanda. He's only 83. 83? 82. No, 3 million. I'm going to... Do you know what? I'm going to go for Mandanda, actually. There'll be a much better goalkeeper that shows up in a... Like, afterwards, but... I think I'll go with the first goalkeeper I can get. And you watch now, I won't sell my goalkeeper. <laughs> I will offer 3.5, because normally when they're over... Oh, oh. 
3.5 because normally when they're over 30 you don't have to worry too much there you go Ray Mandander over here didn't do too well at Crystal Palace but he wants to be crucial absolutely one year that's fine no release clause perfect he wants 17 and a half cool that's less wages than he already has I am fine with that I I really like it when they sort their own wages out because I can't be asked <laughs> uh, oh, I probably should have done the whole age thing Check Kiate. <laughs> Check Kiate. Check Dunk. I really can't remember the over. Evans is a good one. I know Evans is a good one, so I'm just gonna have him scouted. Just in case. Um Douglas doesn't look good. He's a free agent, so I think that tells me what I need to know. Um Fallback. Was Miramon good? I don't think he was. Oh, he's got 14.1 million release clause. That must mean he's worth quite a bit. Scout him. Scout him. Oh, no. You were scouting him. Whoops. Uh, scout him. I know they're both right backs, but might as well just see which one's better. Um... I don't need to worry about wingers because of the formation I'm playing. Um, so, tell you what. I wanted to edit that one. Uh, attacking mid. And then, where's a the winger? That one. Edit instruction. Defensive mid. First team quality. Defensive minded. Why not? Right, time to put Mandanda in my squad. Do 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 do. Boop. And boop. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So I just need to look at filling the other places. So I'll scout Boyata because I just want to see what his overall is. And sometimes it's like if they're under 30, then it's a bit like a, you know, uh, scout him anyway, why not? Uh, because I have a feeling thingy's one would be the 73. Oh, I've got some offers. Here we got Farkas has been sold. Cool. Offer a player in 540,000. Player's overall is 70. So not really going to use him. Delegate that one. And go for that, please. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I was hoping to sell him. I was like, I don't need the goalkeeper. So. Right, what have we got? Weber sold, Bernade sold, Barisha's got a nine and a half million. Um, I'll take nine and a half. Can put some uh, effort into a striker then. Right, let's check what the top transfers are currently. The so Martinez to Real Madrid, 104.7 million. Uh, Varane to Bayern, 59.9 million. Vardy to Liverpool, 57.3 million. They might come calling for Daka. <laughs> uh, Ginter to Arsenal, 43 million. Berardi to Chelsea, 42.5 million. Kramerich to Leverkusen, 38.7. Lucas Moura to Juventus, 31.5. Uh, 
Uh, already done the Alamo. Basuma's gone to Newcastle again for 24.8. Aurea to Atletico Madrid for 23.3. Payet to Hovenheim for 16.8. Um, anyone else of note? Lanzini to FC, how you pronounce that? 11.9. Matt has gone to Wolfsburg again. You tend to get some like repeated transfers, but there are some like other ones that do switch around a bit. I've not really had Kane go anywhere, which is weird. But then again, it is Tottenham with Kane. I don't think they're willing to let him go. Um, eh. It's not too bad, not too bad. Oh, I jumped into the thing too early. Let's keep it going, keep it going. There we go. Who's this? 6.4 million. Yeah, it's close enough to the top lot. Well, I haven't got to the scouting reports yet. Come on. Oh, something's going on. Barisha's been sold. Right, so what positions need to be filled currently if, with these sold players? Central defensive midfielder, central attacking midfielder, striker. Okay. I can definitely do that. You watch, one of them is going to go, do you want Haaland? It's like, I've literally got 15 million in budget. Does he? Ah, there we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Dak has got a transfer offer. Fenerbahce. Want a trade and 13.3 million. Look, both the Zambians are almost on the way out. Um, Delegate. Um, put that down to 15 million. And then 10.5 minimum. DACA should be between 22 million and 32.7 million. Really, that's how much I can get from him. Uh, then go for that. I will take that money. Uh, okay, what else have we got? Uh, so Boyata, what's his overall? 78, not too bad. 10.5 million. Um, 76, five and a half million. It's all right. Um, I mean, if I had the budget for Neuer, I'd take Neuer. Uh, right, who are the other ones? Kiate is a 78, ten and a half million. Evans is 80, 12.5 million. Dunk is 78 and 12 million. Zoom is 81, 27 and a half million. Yeah, that's a no-go. Um, these ones would be low overalls. So, um, you know, uh, let's look at these ones. 73, is that? Yeah, could be better. Um, two point eight million needs to seventy four. It's not too bad. His release clause is five point nine, so I could actually probably get him for less than that. Um. God, it's so difficult. I'll advance it a few days, and I'll see what happens. Oh, Tottenham have got someone. Okay, it's not the person I thought it was. I was going to say, if it's De Vries again. Man City have got... Oyarzabal, however you say it. They've done that about three times. Um, Weghorst to Barcelona. Correa's gone to Leicester. Savage to Dortmund. So Yinchu's gone to Monaco for 28 million. Leicester are getting a lot of money here. Aurea to Atletico Madrid. Uh, oh, they did a little swap deal by the looks of it, <laughs> essentially. Um, any other ones? Already done the Lanzini one. Pereira to Valencia for 10 million. 
That's, that's pretty much it. That's all right. It'll, it'll be here on if you ever want to watch it on catch up. It'll also be on my YouTube. Uh, thank you again for tuning in. It's nice having a little chat with you. Uh, 4.35. Oh, that's bottom of the barrel. Give me more. Oh, his release clause has been met. 45,000 is his release clause. <laughs> 45,000? Is he going to send me a message like, Oh, I'm sorry it had to be this way. It's like, dude, you're 45,000. Calm down. Alright, what other one? Central defensive mids. Okay. Let's have a look. Um... Uh, Mendy's fine, I guess. Um, Sanchez, I don't think you will be. Scout Mendy. So he's a 76, only 5.5, so that's not too bad. Plus, I think it's actually more than... Uh, oh yeah, because they were looking for the midfielders originally. I'll put in a bid for 6 million for him. And then I'll, I'll see what I can get from it. Cool. Let's bring in Hector. He wants to be crucial. That's fine. Uh, two years? Does one release clause? That's fine. Can you sort your wages out? Never mind, I'll do it. Do you want 22,000 still? Does that work for you? Yeah. Older guys are so much easier to get. Which, I kind of wish I just said that with context now. But I do have context, so. Um, fullbacks. These are 74. Um, he's a 73. Scout him. I'll edit that one. I'll just say he's a first team quality, uh, fullback. Uh, don't need that one. Let's change that to just striker. That's over 30. And first team quality. Let's try world class as well. I just want to see what comes up. I mean, it will still be expensive probably. Right, about 34 million to mess with as well. So. Right, let's bring in that new player. Is he central defensive mid? No, he's a central attacking mid. No, he's a centre mid, which is why it's messing up. Right, okay.
didn't win that one. Ugh. <sighs> What's he been on about now? Is this the one that's leaving on the release clause? I've been reading some of the stuff that people have been saying about me and my- Oh, whatever. I'll think about it. Hey boss, I know people have been talking about the- Oh, you got the same thing. Hey boss, I know people have been talking about the position you play me and I just wanted to say I'm ready to do whatever is necessary to make successful. I'm happy to play as a right winger if that's part of your plan. Uh. You can be even better. They don't even have the winger position, so... If Real Madrid signed. Joel Matip. For 41 million. Looks like they're building their team. Sale agreement. 4.45 million. So it's a little bit up from before, I guess, which is fine. Uh, between three and a half and five point whatever. Yeah, go for it. Let's advance a few days. Oh, Leicester assigned someone. Boating. It's an interesting one. Wow. Uh, Bayern really spending the big money there. He's gone to Man U again. <laughs> I've had that three times now. Matip to Robert 41.6 million career. I think we've already done that one. Uh, Lacazette to Milan again, 30.2 million. Boateng, I guess to replace the entry. Not a bad replacement. Um, John McGinn's gone to Wolfsburg, 21 million. Uh, Victor Moses to Sevilla. Uh, any other ones? That Lee fellow's gone to Leeds. I'm going to check the recent ones here. I just want to see what pops up. Because some of them go a bit under the radar for some reason. Okay, maybe another one under the radar there. Uh, right, another player has been sold, which is fine. I'm getting me some money. That's a weird headline. Genk sign bargain boy. Vachi's been sold. Ah, DACA negotiations broke down. Oh, I guess because I was kind of asking for a lot for him. I'll get, I'll get there eventually. Right, so what positions do I need to focus on now? Another central defensive mid, a defender, striker. Is that scouting in progress? Oh yeah, because I can afford Koulibaly. Look into Tompkins. Huntington won't do. Look into him. Uh, where's that other 30 something year old that popped up? Him. Oh, yeah, Cahill was 76, wasn't he? 2.2 .2 million. It's not too bad. Tell you what, I'll shortlist him in the transfer hub for now. Oh, it's probably because his contract's expiring in 12 months, which is why he's so cheap. Oh, Shane Duffy's already moved. Diallo looks rubbish. Look at Marcelo for me. Yeah, because I have 68 million to spend. I have 20, I don't know, 27. Actually, I probably do have 27.5, but I just really don't. He has potential. The defending is green, so there's potential there. Uh, 
Um, Douglas, not so much. Okay. Um, let's have a look at striker. So Josh King, which is like he's fine. Look at Shane Long. Um, I know Inketi is not that good. Tell you what, let's edit that first instruction as well. Uh, edit that, get rid of prolific and pacey. And uh, let's just go for attack minded. I mean, if a striker is not attack minded, it's concerning. Um, okay. Um, I guess with some of them, I could literally just put like search for any player that's got a year on their contract. Right, so I've still got a month left in the transfer window. I've only signed two players, and I've probably sold about seven. Do, do, do. Right, Romalo's got a transfer offer. Bournemouth for 3.15. Yeah, why not, Bournemouth? Go on. Player chat. Who's talking to? Africa, so thanks for giving me the chance to show you what I can do. Outstanding, son. No idea who you are. But I'll go with it. Uh, final scout report, final scout report, Wepu, 10.5, I will take 10.5 for him. Um, right, what's Mendy's overall? 76, and for 6 million. Um, tempting, what's Bernard? 71. I'll t do you know what? I'll take Mendy. I'll put in seven million. I think if they go above ten, then I'll reject it because I don't want to spend over ten million on a seventy-six overall. Can I offer seven million for him? Thanks, Brendan. You're me, my favourite. Must be crucial. That's fine. You're gonna be playing in the team. Three years on his contract. No release clause. And your wage. Fifty thousand. Thanks, Bendy. It's all right. I'm waiting for the results for Tomkins and Long now. So I'll I'll check for other ones they found for fullbacks. Can't remember what Fabio's was, the scout Fabio for me. Uh check him. Check him. If he's got 3.1 release clause, there's potential there. He's a 74, so I'll shortlist in the transfer hub for now. He was a 73. Shortlist him as well. And that one I'm not going to look at. Uh, set and back, I'm waiting on five scout reports. Uh, 
Um, that one's still checking. Okay. I think if that other one doesn't have anything after a week, I'm going to change it. So I just put first in quality, world class, let's say for 30. Tell you what, let's edit that one actually. I think if I get rid of the world class. Because I think trying to find someone over 30 that's world class, it's struggling. I know Lauren Dosky would be one. Um, scout him. Scout him. I just want to see what comes up for them. Okay. Um... So let's put Mendy in the team. So central defensive mids are sorted. God, I have like no reserves. Crap, I'm going to need to start signing players. Um, yeah, let's see what I can fill up. So I'll wait for the scout reports to come back. And then... Romalo's been sold, so I have one reserve spot left. That's not good. Wepu's been sold. I have no reserve spots left. Cool. And now I need central attacking mids. Right, let's have a look. Tell you what, I can actually do that now. Um, oh, Che Adams has got Jay Rodriguez, Benteke, 74, it's not too bad, he's only 3.8 million. Uh, scout Jay Rodriguez, add him to the transfer hub. Jay Adams is going to be like a 73, 72. Well, he's got a big release clause. Harry Wilson is going to be quite expensive. Um, let's edit that other one actually. So attack in mid. Let's do a playmaker instead. We'll see what comes up. Wait, we won by quite a bit. Oh, Mendy got a goal. Oh, Daka missed a penalty. Or had a goal disallowed. I'm not sure what that means. I think that means goal disallowed. I think the, pe the missed a penalty is when they put the little penalty box. But I can't remember. Right, we've got some final scout reports here. Got quite a few. Right, Tompkins is a 75. Shane Long 73 and 1.8. Charlotte's in Chazza Hub. Um, yeah, because I can get Laporte. Norgard's not too bad. Oh, it's a central defensive mid. I'm already sorted there. Oh, Benteke's a 74 and 3.8. So, I might go for Shea Long. I know it's like just a one overall less, but he's not too expensive. So, let me check what my, um, oh, Marcelo, what's Marcelo? Six million for a 78 centre-back. Yeah. Uh, what are the other ones? Grippo. 69, rubbish. 70, rubbish. Uh... 70, 
Oh, right, it was the one I literally just looked at. Mayo, 74, 1.8 million. What was the other one? 78 and a 6 million? Which one was it? Marcelo. 78 and a 6 million. Um, right, transfers, scout instructions, oh, still got defensive mid, that's why. Change that to, any, first team quality, they're that age and they have one year left in their contract. I really want to see what comes up. Right, so did I put any of those other ones in? Uh... That was 80 and 12.5. He was 78 and 10.5. 78, 10.5. Okay, I'll go. I'll go for the other one that I've got. And then I think that's my defense sorted. No. Um. I could go for Evans again. Right, let's do let's do some transfers. Let's get some players in. Cahill's seventy six. How much was he? Two point two. Cahill and that other one I'll go for. So I've got my defenders sorted. is fine. Release clause and he wants twenty six and a half thousand. Absolutely fine. Uh what's he a seventy four? I'll have Ben Take. I like the idea. No, I'll have Shane Long. Cause Shane Long is much cheaper. Ah you damn it. I guess I'll go for Ben Teke then. Could I just offer six million for this player? Like maybe I'll get him for that price. Six. Eight point three with a five percent. Sure, whatever. Bruno rule seventy eight, it's fine. Squad roll, crucial. Two years. No release clause. And... 40,000 wages. Cool. Um, so we've got 2.8 and a 1.4. Same scenario. Let's put 1.5 for this one. I think it might actually be worse than who I've got there, but I'll take a new player.
important. Two years. No release clause. And I'll just give you the same wages as your other club. He wants a bit more. That's fine. It's not too bad. Right, let's add some players to our squad. So we've got Cahill. Got Marcelo. And we got you. Oh, you are a bit worse. Um, I sit you on the bench for now. Hopefully, he might be sold. Um, put you here. Okay. Uh, just drop. Yeah. Let's go forward a few days. I'm sure I can get a decent striker. I've got plenty of money. There we go. Final scout reports. So what we got? Fabio is a 74 left back. He's a 74 striker. Bernard's a 71 left back. I think we already had that one. That's the one I literally just looked at. Barragan. He's a 73 right back. Okay, so he's the same as the other one. More expensive though. Um, you are a 76 right back for 6 million. Uh, you probably would have done actually. Um, that's fine. You're a 74 centre back, which I looked at. And you're a 71 striker. Okay. So I think these are the ones that have like a year on their contract. That's some of them are. So I just need a better left back at the moment. If I can get one. Um, centre backs, I'm fine now. Rodriguez still has five days on his search. God, his stats don't look good at all. Shane Long is a 73, but he's on loan at Southampton. Okay, let's keep it going. I getting a no? I think the gain's broken. I broke the game. Uh, Alright, give me a quick minute. Because, um, yeah, the game's a bit broken. So if you give me a quick minute, I think it might take me off completely. If it does, I apologise. I'll go straight back on the stream. And then I think when it comes to the video, I'll just try and merge them. Ok, 
Okay, I'm back. Did we go audio? Yep, okay. So, I've had to close the game down and reopen it. Hopefully, one of the auto saves wouldn't have lost too much. I guess it, for some reason, just could not handle opening the emails. I don't know why. Never had that happen. But, uh, I know I've seen people complain about stuff like that before. But that's the first time I've ever had it happen. Right, load. Let's get the latest autosave. Or is it 131 now? Okay, there may be a couple of minutes missing. A couple of minutes, a uh, couple of days. So, I think it would have saved after I signed the place. So, so I like that thing up there. The players there are Haaland, Mbappe and Jao Felix. Why do you need those three players at the same team? Right, let's advance. Let's hope it's not broken again. Right, squad. Okay, so I've still got the players. Which is good. Um, Did I change any? I changed some an instruction, didn't I? So I might just have to change it again. Uh, so I don't need central defensive midfielders. I don't need centre backs. So, remove that. Still need a fullback. Um, still need attacking mids. Striker first team quality is in the 30s. Uh, and then that is anyone with a thingy remaining on their contract. Like with a year remaining on their contract. Um, let's make this one specifically left back. And I'm going to go with Pacey. Let's go for a pacey left back. See what happens. I've got uh, 31 million to spend, essentially. I think if all else fails, I'll try and get Ben Teke. Um. Oh, Pogba's gone Real Madrid as well. Bloody hell, 71.3 million. Jesus has gone to Inter for 63.2. Um. Any other ones here of oh, note? Aspas has gone to Leicester as well. 36.8 million. Not the first time that's happened. I think they've done a combination of Aspas and Correa before. Uh, to cover for um, Fardy going. Brendia has gone to Juventus for 30 million. Never seen that before. Uh, Tarkovsky to Wolves for 27.8. Yanazai to Crystal Palace for 24.9. Um... John McGinn to Wolfsburg, 21.1. Jesus Navas to Arsenal for 19.8. Uh, Ansi Fati to Leipzig for 18.3. Lucas Leiva to Spurs for 18 million. Um, ben White's gone to Sheffield United for 16.3 million instead of Arsenal for 50. Brighton, uh, uh, Sheffield United now to work a bargain. Max Ahrens has gone to Lyon for 16 million. Some interesting signings there. Uh, let's check some of the recent ones, just to see what's gone on. Uh, Ashley Barnes has gone on loan. Uh, any other interesting ones here? Not particularly. Just some of my ones thrown in there. There are the scout reports, and they were fine, I guess. Uh, right, just so I don't have the same thing happen, we're going to save it. I went in the training thing. Let's uh, skip that.
Stankovic release clause has been met. 3.95. That's the goalkeeper? Which is fine. I'm trying to get rid of you anyway. I like how I'm just giving him shit. It's like, yeah, just leave. I don't care. Just go. Um... So what I need? Centre attacking mids and strikers. Let's check the transfer, see what comes up. Rodrigo still has two days going. He's a 74, 1.6. That's not too bad. So I'm going to shortlist him. Um, oh yeah, Shane Long I can't have. Tell you what, put him back in. Oh, he's on loan. Damn it. <laughs> oh, he's on loan at Bournemouth. Oh, okay. I say, some of them don't look too great. These are just playmaker, centre attacking mids. Scout Rodriguez. He's a bit older, so he might be a bit cheaper. Uh, I think these are the ones that are a year in the contract. Some of those I've seen before, so. So he was a 74, shortlist him. He could be an interesting one, Sully March. Ah, oh, Falsy Mensa. I think he's just, yeah, he's just joined. I'm still waiting on that one. Okay. Um, then a pacey left back. Okay. Let's carry on for a couple of days. So sim this one. Don't care about the player complaining when he's like, Oh, you didn't play me, but you said you would. I said I'd think about it. Hey, get in, Daka. Uh, yeah, sure, yeah, yeah. Ryan Babble. I mean, I don't do left wings. He's a left mid, 76. I could switch the formation up a bit and scrap the centre attacking mids altogether. 
I'll take Ryan Babel. So I think I'll change it to a... Was it a 4-4-2 but holding? So he's going to be crucial. Once a year. Disregard the release clause. And... 45. Is that fine for you? Cool. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to make it a 424 holding formation. And I will just look for a right mid instead. Um, squad. Uh, formation. Uh, there we go. What's four one two one two? Oh, let's do that. Oh, why does it move them around? Hang on. So put you there. Put you there. So you can play up there for now. You coming off. Oh, he's not here yet. I've got to wait for it to go through. So he can stay there for the time being. If it does come through, then I will look for a right mid. Um, so in that case, scout instructions, uh, remove that one, position, well let's just say, no let's say right midfielder, uh, pacey, first team quality, I like some pace on my players. Oh, Rodriguez's thing came through, didn't it? So, let's see what his over... I think it's a 75? 74, and he's 3.2. I will take Jay Rodriguez. So, we've got a 74. So, oh, so he's a 74, 1.6, and he's a 74. I'll take both of them. Why not? That way I've got my strikers sorted, just in case. 3.2. I'll just give him his value. How about that? They want a little bit. Ah, that's fine. 3.65. At least it's not 5 million. Let's do your weekly wages, boy. It could be crucial. He wants two years. That's fine. Uh, disregard release clause. He wants 23,000. Absolutely fine. It's so nice when the players actually decide their wages. Because I'm like, I really can't be able to try and figure out what's decent. Transfer fee. Let's just do the exact same price as you are. Oops, uh, find that out one. There you go. Uh, right. His wages are quite low, aren't they? So I could probably just offer him the same. Yeah, I'll, I'll offer him 20,000. Let's just say you're important. Uh, two years? No release clause? Yeah, I mean, who would want to buy a 35 year old? And he wants 15th. Oh, you're a saint. Thank you. There's my two strikers. There's 74 left back. So he's going to stay there for the time being. Right, so strikers are mostly sorted. If a better one comes along, I'll get a better one. But for now, 
I'm going to put Rodriguez up front. The other one can sit on the bench. Oh, Rodriguez. Yeah, welcome to Austria. And... You can see that. Uh, so... If Babel comes through, which will be very interesting, then right mid's definitely what I'm going for next. And then that should be pretty much every place covered, like apart from left back, but I could always. The other player is sitting in the wings, so. Oh, I really don't care, Stankovic. Doesn't help much, I don't care. At least I got money off him, so. Doesn't matter. Oh, here man you got. Uh, no idea who that is. Alright, let's check some more of these. Oh, Campbell's gone from Stoke to Chelsea, 4.5 million. Oh, Brozovic, 41.4 million, central defensive mid. Longstaff's gone to Croton on loan. caviero has gone to Mainz on loan. Baumgartner's gone to Aston Villa for 28.5 million. Uh, Jerry Rodriguez to me. Kieran Clark to Lille for 4.25 million. Adel Tarat, 8.4 million to Hellas Verona. Pablo Mari's gone to Levante on loan. Uh, Lamella's gone to Atletico Madrid. 17.4 million reuniting with Aurier MacArthur to Strasbourg for for almost 5 million uh, okay let's check the top transfers I just want to see if anything recent's happened or any, I'd say anything recent like any new top transfers uh, we've already had Jesus to enter Matip obviously to Real Madrid 41 million Everything looks pretty much the same. No one really up note that I can think of. Boateng to Leicester, which very hard. Graven Birch to West Ham, 26.7 million. Hector Bellerin to Everton for 19.5 million. Okay. Yeah. Um... So I'm doing pretty alright with my squad. Let's keep advancing the time. I wonder if a Dakar one's going to come through in the last one. Christensen's been sold. Opposition to Z play. Oh, that means that Babel should be coming in. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> so right mid. Uh, should we see if they come up with one? There's a there's a couple. Scout him. Give him a scout, I guess. Um. Well, I can change some of those instructions now. Edit. Right midfielder. First team quality. I'd say regular first team quality. Um. First team quality. Let's say strong.
Yeah, Rodriguez, two goals. And then Daka got one as well. Doing pretty well. Oh, we're top of the league. Right, Sully March is 75 and 6 million, which isn't too bad. Oh, Wesley, you're rubbish. Scout Dan James, I want to see how much he's worth. If not, I'll put in a big bid in for him. <gasps> All Brighton! Ah, Pookie, you'll be like a 76, I think. Troidini. Well, I've already got a couple of strikers now. Walcott, 76. Um, short... Oh, I don't want to view him. I'll shortlist him. At least it's there. Ah, oh, Ivanovic. Oh, he's 74. He's only 675,000. I'm so tempted to sign him just as like a backup. Okay. Um, so Walcott's there, but I can scout the other two. If I don't scout them in time, then I guess Walcott's my option. Oh, I don't. I don't think the scouts can be quick enough. I think that's going to be the issue. Yeah, because the deadline's coming up. Uh, rubbish. Absolute rubbish. So, Sully March is good for a left back. And then I've got Walcott. Okay, he managed to get one. He's a 76 right mid, 10.5 million. Walcott's cheaper. Okay, so I guess I've got my players sorted. Not like transfer wise. I think I know who I want. So, transfers, transfer hub. Oh, I forgot to get Sully March. Okay, um, approach to buy. No, Walcott. Okay. Um. Right, so all Bryson's there, James is there. I've got 31 million. Right, where's... uh? What position was it? Fullback? Where's he gone? Yeah, because I have 43 million to spend. Where did Sully March disappear to? Because that one was actually alright. Tell you what, I'm still wasting time here. I could just go in there. Oh, I could just press Y. Never mind. Solly March. There we go. 75, 6 million. Shortlist and view in Transfer Hub. He's 26. So let's put 8 million for him. Thank you, Potter. Potter. Come on, let's get you to Salzburg. He wants to be important, that's fine. Uh, three years. Disregard release clause. And your wage. 35,000. Yes. Thank you. Um. Right, so by the looks of it, 
All Brighton's actually better than James in a lot of things. I might go for All Brighton. Value is six and a half million. His wage is fifty nine thousand. His value is ten okay. That's literally all I needed to know, it's all up here. So um shortlist and view and transfer hub. I'm gonna offer seven point five for All Brighton. And then try and give him whatever bloody wages I've got. Offer transfer fee. Seven point five million. There we go. I think all Brighton's a seventy six. I think. Maybe. He wants to be crucial. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Uh two years. No release clause. Oh, fuck him, whatever sort your wages out. Fifty. I've got the spare budget. Thank you. Cool. Right, let's fill in those spaces. All Brighton, 76. I will take that. And then March is a 75. Push him up slightly. Um, right, Ulmer can sit there. Locker four. Sit there. I think that's alright. Yeah, I've pretty much replaced every position apart from Daka, but I've got a spare striker here. So I've actually managed to get 11 players in. Which is pretty cool. I think that's probably the most I've actually got in, because obviously before it's like I've only filled for the positions I've needed to, but I've had to fill for every position. So I've done alright. I think I've sold about 16 players. Right, let's just keep advancing the time. Asper Laqueta's gone PSG. Interesting. Right, what we got? Ulmer. There we go. I mean, I've literally just replaced him, so I don't mind if he goes. There's all mine. <laughs> Oh, Real Madrid have got someone. I think that was my player being sold. Yeah. Good thing I got myself a left back then. I know there's a spare one, but... Um... Right, let's check the top deals. Uh, oh, Skirina has gone to Real Madrid for 90 million. Uh, Aubameyang, Barcelona, 61.1 million. Busquets to Inter for 60.9 million. Uh, Moreno has gone to Arsenal for 54.6 million. Um, Ward Prowse has gone to Monaco for 38.5 million. alderweireld has gone to Manchester United for 36.9 million. Zaha's gone to Roma for 36.5 million. Uh, Rudiger to Atletico Madrid, 33.6 million. Got that going very defensive, Atletico. Um, who else have we got here? Tarkovsky to. Oh, I've already done that one. Um, Play's gone to Leipzig, 25.7 million. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, let's check some of the latest deals. Um, see who pops up. Um, Cresswell to Sociedad for 17 million. Uh, Dwight Gale to Elsha on loan. Delph has got to Freiburg on loan. Um, yeah. Some interesting signings there. See if we get any last minute mental ones.
But I guess no one else wants Daka. Phil Jones has gone to West Ham on loan. Uh, Twanzebe has gone to Benevento on loan. Uh, Kimbempe to Liverpool for 57.4 million. Jordan Ayew to Marseille on loan. Uh, yeah, pretty much caught up there. Right, what budget do I have? So I technically have no wages. And 60, oh, 60 million, 20,000 wages. I could, if I wanted to, get another player, but I don't know who to get. I could jokingly get Deeney in, but I think he's only like a 74 or 75. Um, Shane Long's on loan, Benteke's on loan. Resorted that. Any position, first team quality. Is this the one that's. Yeah, they're over 30. Oh, Ujella. Oh, that is literally like. They know nothing. Oh, yeah, of course. I could. I'm going to put 675,000 in for him. And then I bet it would take much lower wages. And he can just be a backup centre back. I'll make him like a rotation player. Tell you what, 700,000 because I'm nice. Yeah. Uh, right, let's try and get him in. Because <laughs> why not? It's fun. He wants to be important. Sure. He wants a year, sure. He wants a 1.1 million release clause, sure. <laughs> Do you want to sort your wages too? Why is that the only thing you can't sort? 30. Cool. Free agent, left back. Ah, Shane Duffy. Oh yeah, but he's already moved somewhere else. 8.8 .8 million release costs. Must mean he's worth something. Ish. He's not a bad striker, is he? 77. I could do with a 77. Does that have Dini's value on here? Sod it. Approach to buy. <laughs> Why not? What what budget have I got? Has 10 million sound. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, now I gotta try and sort out his wages. Although I've technically got none. This might bankrupt me. I may have paid way too much for Dini, but who cares? He wants to be important. Yeah, sure. He wants a year. Sure. Discraft release clause. Oh, why do I have to sort your bloody wages out? 30,000. Yeah! I've got Troy Deeney! <laughs> What's his, uh... Let's have a look. What is, uh... His overall is like 72, probably. He's a 74. Which isn't too bad. Ivanovic is a 74 as well. So I've got a few 74s in. It's not too bad. I'd say there's been like quite a bit of improvement on this team. I mean, maybe the right backs did. Oh, I didn't get a right back, did I? But now I don't have the money for it. Oh well. Right back's the only issue. Oh no, I got that right back in, didn't I? Yeah, that was the right back I got. And I was like, oh, he's worse than the last one I got in. So... 
That's fine. I've done some decent signings, I think. And I got Mandanda in goal, so that's a big one. Right, let's get to the next game. See what other transfers have happened. I'm a wanted man, apparently. Oh, now it comes through, does it? Seventy-five for a right mid. Well, I've already got seventy-six, so it does not matter anymore. Daniel James finds scout report. Let me guess, seventy-six. Yeah, ten and a half million seventy-six. Which is fine because I got all Brighton at 76 as well. And for cheaper. Right. Let's keep this going. Because I want to see if anything else comes up. Um, right, so it's a squad ready. Yes, it is. Yeah, because I did sign that player. So I have signed for every position. I've got two backup strikers now. Dakar's gone up to a 78. Get in, Dakar. Um, and yeah. So, yeah not, so these are going to be my three subs, I think. I'll bring them on at some point. But I think... I've probably signed almost as many players as I sold, which isn't too bad for me, because normally I sell a lot of players and only get in like seven. But the fact I've managed to like replace the entire squad, like I know Dak is still there, but uh, you know I've got two strikers just in case. Oh, I tell you what I didn't talk about, which I could probably actually talk about during this game. Uh, the Premier League today. I've had the joy of watching the Man U Leeds match. Uh, it was great to see Man U do it very well. Uh, Leicester also winning against Wolves. Kind of wish it was more than a one-goal game. But, you know, they got the winner, which is important. Um, didn't get to watch the Liverpool Norwich game, but I've watched the highlights of it. Uh, Chelsea did, had a strong showing. Uh, Watford won on the way up. Um, yeah, Brighton managed to win theirs. They did go down. Uh, they were down 1 0 first. I'm excited for Tottenham Man City tomorrow with the whole Kane saga going on. Uh, Newcastle, West Ham should be fun. West Ham doing a great job last season and Newcastle now having pretty much their best player of last season. Uh, like finally getting him from Arsenal. Yeah, getting Dakar. I do like this kit quite a bit. Oh, one of their players has got an injury already. Well, he's lost the ball. That's all Brighton. Oh, there he is. Why is he in the back? I guess because my right back ran out. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Keeper not concentrating. Oh, that was a rubbish throw. Good defending. Say so Dakar's got all the pace I need. Got Dakar, run! Well, that's how to beat your opponent. No hiding from the fact ah. that they really should have extended their lead. Well, he knows putting his team two up would have been a big, big move in this game.
Poor pass under no real pressure. And unable to keep the ball. Oh, Dak is in again. Yes. I need to have a look. I want to see how... Because I think Dak has scored like, what, 47 goals last season? Fifty goals and assists he got apparently. Uh it's going their way, two nil. Just give me one second. So last season twenty seven was it twenty eight games, twenty seven goals. So 42 games, 34 goals, 12 assists, which is not bad at all. Okay. You can see why let's sign him. Like I like I said, I, re like, I really hope he can bring those goals over for Leicester. I'm sure he will. Like, especially in Cups. Like but I would like to see it in the Premier League as well. And He's got a lot of pace on him as well. Run! Oh, that's fine. That's offside. And breaking at pace with Menace. Oh, look at that. Daka gets through. He's situation. off. Oh, that's a goal. Look at that shot power. Excellence in finishing. There for all to see. He's a lethal striker. For them. Three nil. Rep. Oh, look at that. Daka's on the run. Come on, Daka, do it again. Oh, he's paused it back now. Crap. Up defensively. It is fine. All right, Mendy to cross. I've got two. I've just realised I've got two Leicester players, haven't I? I've got Mendy and Albright. It's fine. I'm sure, they won't miss him. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Nope. Of possession. Got it back. Rodriguez. Ah, oh, it's close. Appear to be the high percentage option. Close though. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. Long range effort, and it wasn't too far off, was it? <sighs> uh, it wasn't. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Oh, lost it. And he saw the situation developing. Plenty of options. So, yeah, so I ended up having a slight formation change. Uh, I've just changed the centre attack mids possession. into left and right mids. So, it's not a massive, like I said, it's not a massive change. Now the attack but it still out. looks mostly familiar. On and on he goes. Oh, nice ball oh, no. over the top to chase. Yeah, nice save, man. Down with really flabby finishing there. Yeah, Dakar's on the run. Go on, Dakar, you got it. Look at the speed, boy. On the touch line. Chances on. Oh, he's got. He's well, cutting hey. on the inside. Oh, fine oh. Save. He's given a corner. They referee. Uh. Wow, Albrighton's better in every single way. Go on, Albrighton. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you take a corner. Come here, give me a high five. Never mind, I'll go to the corner. 
Well, here's the replay, Derek. It's a good, strong ball into the box, and that's a hey, good Marcelo. eye on the ball. Concentration. It's a lovely finish. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Promising sequence. Babo. Oh, Babo. Ah, it's been blocked. Rep. There to win it back. Really get right, stuck in it. defensively. Oh, get him, Mendy. And a poor oh, ball. Got it. Albrighton to Rodriguez. To Daka. Oh, Daka's overstepped him. Daka! Oh, yes! It's one goal after another. And that speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, as we see from the replay, the keeper's got no chance. It's all about the strike. There's four goals for him now. He does everything right. Head down, back in the net. Well, it's been such a one-sided game. It's just the speed. It's so nice to have. Oh, Mendy, yes. That's a well -timed pass. Oh, he's through again. That's so nice. And he's come up with it. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. Apparently, as well, a new thing they've got in FIFA 22 is the last minute the celebration. So, like, if you score in, like, added on time to win the game, they do, like, the massive everyone jumps in on the celebration, which would be very interesting to see. I hope that's an achievement for the game as well. It just means holding out till the end of the scoring. It'll be a corner. Played into the centre of the box. The save was a good one. Oh, I thought it was one of those, like, saves where it would have just gone in. Over it comes. Got Marcelo, do it again. Ah, oh. so Marcelo's good at winning headers. So I might keep him on. Uh, right, let's do the substitutions then, so they get a half as well. So, Daka for Pele, Dini for Rodriguez, and Cahill off. Was Cahill 76 or 75 when I got him? I can't remember. Uh, and then Ivanovic on. They aren't the fastest, but they're strong. So that's all that matters. They're the solid. Are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. All Brighton down the wing. Oh, he's turned him. Oh, he's turned him. That ah, fine challenge in that would have been a great goal. No nonsense clearance. Marcelo gets his head on it. Oh, Red. never mind. Oh, God. I was letting through. Yes, quality. get in, Marcelo. Oh, no. That was a bad pass. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Hector de Pelé. This looks threatening. To Dini. Go on, Dini. Oh, ah. Bloody rain. Well, that important piece of transfer news previously unconfirmed, but now official. Milan Skriniar has completed his move to the Bernabeu. That's Skriniar. Well, I think everybody would be excited by this transfer. He's a real star turn, a proper player. I'd love to have played with him. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. All right, I don't have the pace of Dakar anymore. So, Dini, you're going to have to run for it. Go on, Dini. You've got it. No, you don't. No, he did, but he didn't. Good work to win it Pressure. Back, yes. The pitch. Good play it in. Opportunity. A oh, terrific piece oh, of Oh, good save. Giving. Right, Marcelo, get your head on it again. Oh, I don't mind. Pele almost got it. Offside, a tight one. Ah. Oh, 
Ardini with the turn. Well, what a oh, he scores. saved it again. Dini might not score today. I think I left it at six minutes. By the way, it's taking a bit longer. Oh, it could be four. It is going quite quickly ish. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. No, I think it's at six because I've been Dini. doing some ultimate team. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Tremendous oh, he's offside. Why don't I pass to him? And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. This attack looks highly promising. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Might still be oh. able to do a bit of damage. Oh, God. Well, no damage done. Oh, now they're making their way up. Well, Derek, the stats don't lie. Chance oh, after good block. chance. They've played really, really well. They've really got this defence on toast. They don't know what to do. They're at sixes and sevens. This scoreline could be anything. Oh, he's got past him. Well, he ah, to wide. That time. I was kind of hoping to win a penalty then. Florian uh, Flecker. Dangerous looking attack. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. Well, there might well be scope for them to catch oh, through here. to Pele. They need to get bodies back. It was so near. <sighs> well, that's counter attacking football at its best. Just needed to finish to cap it off. Getting in there to take it away. A good oh, tackle. Oh, come on. Pelé. Well, the defending needed to be a bit more high echelon goalkeeping there. Oh, look. I'm in a coat. And over comes the corner. It comes to absolutely nothing. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And firing it into the area. Oh, I don't get why I've still got Mendy doing it. Targets available. Cross comes in. And a no nonsense clearance. Well, pressing really high. Dini. Oh, go on, Dini. This could be your chance, boy. This could be your chance. Still alive. Oh, he's hit the post. And at the second time of last I don't think Dini's getting a goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Oh, so we're almost approaching the uh, two-hour mark, which isn't too bad. Well, okay, that's that. a yellow. Is on the referee to take action, potentially. And that will mean yeah, a so. caution. Well, definitely a yellow card, Derek. Oh, Brighton! And the keeper had the oh. And the referee has given them a right, corner. change this to all Brighton. Over it comes. Just two more. Ah, Eyes head downwards. One. Close shave though. I like Mendy's trying to win a header despite the fact he's like five foot. Lohian Flecker deserves credit for winning the ball back. Oh God. Beautifully timed. Graziano Pelé. <laughs> Save but still a chance. Raiko Rep. Oh, a 
Oh no! Come on, give it to Ah, never mind. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the yes, best. Yes, it's the 88th minute. It's 7-1. I don't think they're coming back to win this one. Go on, Troy. Looking confident Let's get you a goal. All right, that's a yellow. He blows for a foul. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where uh, he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. He's actually really no good at free card, kicks. But okay. certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Ah, oh, it's rubbish. And the keeper grabbing hold of that the keeper. free kick. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Beautiful pass. Oh, offside. How marginal was that? But the flag is raised. Pelé. Dini. Well, they could keep it. possession. I think he's getting a goal. Getting in there to intercept. I and tried. That, the referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors, Lee. Well, it must be a dream as a striker to play in this team. They create for fun and have a lovely attacking style about them. Clinical finishing today as well. I think they did pretty well there. Alright, let's get through this so it's literally just a two hour video. Oh! Shush! 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 Quiet! Quiet the UEFA Champions League, please! Quiet! 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 I talked over it last time, so hopefully I didn't pick it up before, but I don't know about this time. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Right. Uh, what's he saying? I think you know how fresh I get when I can't play regularly. Just want to say I'm prepared to turn out in any position I think can benefit the team. I'm not stuck on playing in a regular position. I just want to be out there helping the team. I've got you in mind. Don't worry. Shush. Shush, you. Okay, so let's go over the transfers. Oh, Kaka, I remember you. Um, so the transfers that have happened. Uh, so going out, we've had Romalo, Adeyemi, uh, Yunusovic, uh, Bernard, Parkers, Felici, Christensen, Stankovic, Valka, Vuba, Ulmer. That's 11. Oh, Mwepo, Barisha. So that's 13. In, Mandanda, Hector, Mendy, Cahill, Fausera, Marcelo, Pele, Rodriguez, Albrighton, March, Ivanovic, Dini, and Babel. So we've literally traded the exact same players. Out went 13, in went 13. Not bad, if I say so myself. Um... So yeah, thank you for watching this one. Um, I might do another one tomorrow. I might look at streaming something else for a couple of hours. Um, yeah, again, thank you for watching this video slash stream, depending on if you're watching it on Twitch or YouTube. Uh, if you're watching it on Twitch, my YouTube, Instagram and Twitter are all arblington94, uh, all caps. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, my Twitch is twitch.tv forward slash rbillington. Um, and yeah. Uh, like I said, so basically when I stream this, I'll pretty much upload it to YouTube within the following day. And yeah, uh, thank you for watching this one, and I will see you in the next one.